What's up guys, Gio Garcia coming at you with a quick how to put the bag together video. There's been a lot of videos floating around. Our captain, Steve Scanzaroli, just did a video on how to put these together. I'm gonna do another one because it seems like this bag is a little different in regards to where the zippers are and the ease. I guess Prodigy heard everybody's complaints and decided to make it easier for everybody. So let's start with the back panel. And I noticed on the back panel, on the other videos, they said there's a zipper up top. As you can see, there's no zipper up top anymore. Now, there's a zipper that goes all the way around. It's a zip. The zipper's completely open. So I'm assuming that that's how it goes. If I'm wrong, someone correct me. I'm guessing these bags, this newer run, is uh, they fixed that problem to make it easier to put this back insert in because you just drop it in like that in the back and then zipper her on up. And it seems like that gets this back panel in there. Nice and, nice and snug, you can tell. Then uh, I'm gonna start doing, I'm gonna do this front panel here. There's a zipper here in the front. And then this one's probably gonna take a little finessing, I'm guessing. It looks like it doesn't fit, but I'm guessing it probably goes down like this. What I'm assuming. So let's fidget around with this for a minute. See if I can get it in there to fit. I'm assuming how it goes. Maybe it goes the other way around. All right, maybe these little wings go up. Yeah, wings go up. So let's get that in there. Tuck it in here. Tuck it in here. Tuck it in here. It's a little snug for this spot, but I have to assume that that's where it goes. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, so that's in. Let's see if it's a zipper closed. Yep. So that panel's in there. Just gonna mess around with it. Okay. And I'm sure over use time it'll be there. All right, so you got the inside panel there. And then I know there's four other panels my patch um, it goes uh, one goes on the inside here and it seems like that one's gonna be this one fold they kind of warm them up to get them to fit in the side like that so I'm gonna just give it a nice little half fold like that Let's see if I can get it in there and nag away with it a little bit probably should lay it down that up in there. Fidget with it a little bit. I, just, I can see now why people are saying it's a pain in the butt. But once it's in, it should be in. You got to apply a little bit of force to get it in there. But there we go. She's in. You got to play around with it. It's not, not too, too bad. Not too, too crazy. I'm not pulling my hair out yet. Get that panel there. And as I'm, I'm assuming as you play around, it'll settle into place. Once I load it up with this, I'm sure it'll bend it to where it needs to go. There's that. All right, let's do the next panel. This guy here is gonna go this way. Quick little fold here. Actually, I don't think I need to fold it. The zipper's kind of open up all the way, so you gotta get it in. Okay. Get it in, push it up into position, and then just play around with the bottom here to get it to fit into a slot there. Getting these little corners is the problem, it's the hard part, but once it's in, she's in. Yeah. Like I said, once I load it in there, it should be pretty good. All right, those are the side panels, inside side panels, and there's some other panels here, zippers here in the front that are for these. All right, that's in. That's in. There we go. 
There we go. All right. Now this other side. that bad. I didn't pull my I didn't end up pulling my hair out, so that's a good thing. All right, guys. And that's how you put together the new BP1 V3. One last thing to do. There we go. Now it's official. <laughs> All right, guys. So my phone cut out. It overheated. Uh, Florida problems, right? The rest of the country's freezing and my phone's overheating here in Florida, which is a good thing for me. Anyways, this bag wasn't that hard to put together. It didn't give me that much of a headache. I thought I was gonna be pulling my hair out based off of everything else I saw in the other videos. I mean, it was pretty simple. I guess Prodigy changed the design to make it a little easier to insert those panels and to get it all set up. Regarding my setup, I can't wait for my roller to get here. This is gonna look totally awesome. I know a lot of the other Prodigy guys are rocking that setup right now and it looks badass and I'm going with that way too. Just the way it looks, it looks awesome. I hope I get to play more this season with the way things are going here in Florida with COVID, you never know. But hopefully I get out there and be able to compete more. Um, but until then, I'm gonna continue putting out some awesome content for you guys to watch. So be sure to like and subscribe, hit the little bell button to make sure you get all my notifications for the new videos that come out. And as always guys, keep hitting your lines.